Hi, I'm Dolph Gabler from North Sales, and I'd like to show you a different technique in repairing modern sales. Everything that you learned about traditional sail making in repairs and, and fixing things is based on the 1800s of a thing called a sewing machine that takes a thread and a needle and punctures holes and pulls thread through. Today's fibers and fabrics that we're using in sail making are both the gold Kevlar and the black carbon fiber. We need a new way of repairing sails. And the sewing machine is sadly uh, going out its usable uh, life. This is the modern sewing machine. It would be an adhesive gun with a mixer that we would apply a patch as we would with a stitched on sail, but it will now be glued on just as they do with your teeth in dentistry. They use the same gun and a different polymer. As they once said, uh, the future's in adhesives or ball bearings. So what you would carry on board to fix a hole in a sail, such as a rip in a sail or a rip in a plastic sail, would be something to simply patch the hole. And for that, we have a number of different materials that we can choose from. This one is called a polyester, uh, what we lovingly called insignia. It's a polyester cloth with a very strong PSA, pressure sensitive adhesive on the back. And then just before applying the PSA piece, you would use acetone, clean the area of salt and grease with just a quick acetone. Now the area is ready for the exposed PSA glue that's on the polyester. And although it doesn't match in color, that's a very practical repair that it's simply patching the hole itself. It's not a structural repair, it's just a quick fix. The last thing about the PSA that I mentioned, pressure sensitive, means that you need pressure to rub down the area and set the glue. Now that patch, it could go on for the rest of its life. And what this material is, is the same material that this sail is made of. It's called 3DI, but suffice it to say that this is the outer surface, as you see here, which is gray. The inner surface, which is carbon fiber, is in five different directions. Right now, I'm gonna choose that as my little temporary patch. I'm gonna hold it in place. And this can be done on board during a storm <laughs> on the floor of the boat. And I essentially am going around the edges like you might with a sewing machine and then just some general strokes in the middle to hold it all together. Allowing the glue to flow over the excess. Pick up the excess glue. This I find the quickest and easiest kid sand, and it is holding and molding to the shape of the patch, and it holds it down. I wait 12 hours, and it's ready to remove this 24 until it's totally set, and you can go and pressure it up. And that's how you fix a hole in a modern sail.